Yeah, like ever since I was born, I was just a big kid. Like I weighed 12 7 when I was born. And, and life didn't get any easier for Antonio Morales' mom when he grew up because you have to go to the ends of the earth now to shop for this 14 year old. Especially when you're trying to find a specialty shoe for his enormous feet. News Channel 8's Eric Hansen has the story. Catholic school dress codes are intended to make lunchrooms uniform. But at one table, you guys are making me look bad. One freshman can't help but stick out. Not really embarrassed. I just get, it just gets like tired and just hearing the same question over and over again. A question you have to look under the table to understand. How big are your feet? Antonio Morales flew through nines, tens, and elevens in elementary school. Kids would ask, and they'd be like, oh, wow, that's my, that's my dad's size. In junior high, he passed 14s, 15s, and 16s. They'll usually carry one or two shoes, but uh, normally we just order them off the internet. But this summer, about the time he turned 14, his shoes turned 19. Yeah. NBA players aren't much bigger. Only last week, Antonio broke the news. It's something I've always uh, wanted to do and try out. The 6'5 freshman told Coach Garvin he wants to wrestle. And I said, let me make a few phone calls. Because Coach's average size tens are dwarfed by his newest recruits. And I've got a handful of people on it, but uh, so far we're yet to locate a pair of 19 wrestling shoes. His football skis weren't a problem, and tennis boats take double the leather, but they're findable. Now, wrestling? I've never met anybody with bigger feet, but. It's one of Coach Garvin's biggest preseason challenges. If there's not one made right now, they're, uh, you know, we're going to hope that somebody will make one. Because Antonio's determined to wrestle, even if he has to raise the money for them, one question at a time. Like I wish I, like I had a nickel for every time someone asked me how big my feet were. In West Des Moines, Eric Hansen, News Channel 8, Iowa's News Leader. And even collegiate wrestling coaches have never heard of a grappler with feet that size. Antonio's coaches are convinced they will get him equipped, even if they have to go all the way to the manufacturers.